वेलकम टू माय चैनल स्टडी विथ प्रदीप तो टुडे आई विल डिस्कस वीक नाइन असाइनमेंट नाइन आंसर्स ऑफ द कोर्स क्लाउड कंप्यूटिंग प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल एंड प्रेस द बेल आइकॉन आई विल अपलोड ऑल द असाइनमेंट आंसर्स ऑफ दिस कोर्स इन दिस चैनल लाइक वाइज आई एम डूइंग फॉर ऑल द वीक असाइनमेंट नाउ दिस इज क्वेश्चन नंबर वन द एंसर विल बी ऑप्शन बी दैट इज फॉक कंप्यूटिंग एक्सटेंड्स द क्लाउड क्लोजर टू द एज नेटवर्क वाइल एज कंप्यूटिंग प्रोसेस डाटा स्ट्रिक्टली विद इन आईओटी डिवाइसेस और लोकल गेटवे Now question number 2 the answer will be option C that is edge computing now question number 3 the answer will be option C that is edge less than fog less than cloud now question number 4 the answer will be option B that is horizontal scalability across multiple fog nodes now question number 5 the answer will be option B that is fog nodes provide intermediate decision making while the cloud manages global policies and optimizes Now question number 6 what is the primary goal of application placement problem in the cloud fog edge framework so the answer will be option b that is to find available resources in the network that satisfy application requirements respect to constraints and optimize the objectives such as minimizing energy consumption now question number 7 the answer will be option d that is dynamic variability of wireless network conditions and device mobility now question number 8 The answer will be option A. That is, they act as intermediaries uh, that negotiate, discover, and allocate resources across different CSPs. Now, question number nine. Which of the following is a major challenge in cloud federation? So, the answer will be option B. That is, ensuring SLA compliance and interoperability and trust across heterogeneous providers. Now, question number ten. Which of the following best describes a hybrid cloud federation? So, the answer will be option C. That is, a federation where resources from public and private clouds are combined to provide flexible services while maintaining security and control. So. Please subscribe my channel if you get some help from this video. Thank you for watching the video. We'll see you in the next video.